Hey everyone, welcome to Gameplay First, where fun is second to none. My name's Tyler, and evildoers beware, I have waffles. This week I'll be reviewing Injustice Gods Among Us for Xbox 360, PlayStation 3, and Wii U. Injustice is a DC Universe fighting game developed by NetherRealm Studios, the guys responsible for the 2011 Mortal Kombat remake. So right out of the gate, yes, this is an arcade fighter. The game controls more or less like Mortal Kombat or Street Fighter 2, but with a few added bells and whistles. For example, you can actually interact with the environment during fights. And by interact with the environment, I mean use the environment to beat the ever-loving snot out of people with. Now, speaking as someone who is awful at arcade fighters, I'll say that the combos aren't that hard to execute. They've also included the familiar juggling and area transitions, which are always fun, unless you're the one getting locked in them. Not to mention the super moves, which you can use once your meter at the bottom of the screen is full. That's when you get to do your over-the-top, do a ton of damage move to your enemy, and every character has one. Superman knocks his foes into the atmosphere, then punches them back down. Flash runs around the entire planet to punch you in the face. And Aquaman does something that's basically useless. Well, that's a far cry from the Super Friends days. Now, fortunately for me, the Wii U version has the added bonus option of displaying combos on the gamepad screen which was really helpful in my case because, again, I am awful at arcade fighters. I won't even try to disguise this fact, okay? The only reason I was able to beat story mode was because NetherRealm was nice enough to put a very easy option in there, which basically says your opponents will stand still and let you beat the crap out of them just to progress the story. Speaking of which, spoiler alert! Okay, so the story is basically that there's an alternate universe in which Joker sets off a nuke in Metropolis, killing millions of people, including Lois Lane and Superman's son, respectively. He takes it pretty well. Well, at least this time he didn't try to spin the Earth backwards. Anyway, that Superman descends into a pretty dark madness, basically becoming the overlord of Earth. Then a bunch of... I guess our Justice League and some of the villains are transported to the other universe to help stop evil Superman. The story's not exactly amazing, but it's not terrible either. Some of the reasons that the characters have to have fights are a little bit contrived, but at the end of the day it was really cool to get to see this dark side of Superman that we never get to see. And on top of that, a lot of the banter between the characters is really, really funny. In addition to that, the character designs are absolutely fantastic. I love how most of the characters have upgraded from spandex to durable armor. Flash looks so much cooler in plate than in pajamas, and the new designs of Cyborg, Batman, and Wonder Woman look awesome, to name a few. Whether you're a hardcore DC fan or not, there's a character here for everyone. I mean, even three-fifths of the Teen Titans and Slade, I mean, Deathstroke are here. And I'm talking the comic book Teen Titans, of course, not the Cartoon Network Teen Titans. Because, honestly, I can't see a line like this. Evil beware. We have waffles. Working next to a scene like this. Yeah, I think I can stop showing that now. Ugh. On top of that, there is absolutely zero lack of content. I mean, none. Costume unlocks, artwork unlocks, and a wealth of single player modes, and of course, online fights, give this a ton of replay value. Basically, Injustice Gods Among Us is a fantastic game, and it's the DC fighting game fans have waited years to play. And finally, we can settle that argument of who would win in a fight. And for once, the answer isn't always Superman. <laughs> Unless his opponent is Joker's innards. For Gameplay First, this is Tyler, signing off. Now, if you'll excuse me, I'm going to go eat this waffle. <laughs>